And right now, the city lights are back on at Honolulu Holly, celebrating 37 years of holiday cheer and some unforgettable characters. Dallas Ontiveros joins us live with a sneak peek on today's ceremony. Morning, Dallas. Good morning, Christian Ross, and I am joined by our friend once again, Makanani, who's executive director for the Mayor's Office of Culture and Arts. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? We're doing fun. We're doing great. I mean, we've seen so much stuff to preview for the Honolulu City Lights, so it's been a great time. Now, to get people thinking about the holidays, I want to do a quick Christmas either or speed round with you. You ready? All right. Go okay. ahead. Okay. Chocolate chip cookies or sugar cookies? Chocolate chip for sure. Gift cards or presents? Presents. Candy canes or gingerbread men? Ooh, gingerbread. Ref, Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer or Frosty the Snowman? Frosty. And this year, have you been naughty or nice? Ooh, na nice. Na na nice, <laughs> of course. We've all been nice here. And of course, Honolulu City Lights goes on until January 2nd. Yes. Kicks off technically today or tomorrow? Kicks off technically tomorrow. We press the button to start it, but we welcome the public on Sunday, December 5th at 8 a.m. And there's going to be a special ceremony happening tomorrow night, too. Yes, that's when we're going to actually turn on all of the lights. Awesome. And of course, we're just giving you all a preview right here. It looks so much better when it's dark outside, but all these morning drivers are pretty excited to see this glowed up right now. But I'm looking at the top of the tree. Now, we've been experiencing rainy weather. Is Mayor Rick Langiardi still going to put the star on the tree, if, even if it's raining? I guarantee you, Mary, will still be up there, rain or shine, to put that star <laughs> up and finish up these decorations. We've been saying, like, put me in, coach. For Who's sure. Who's going to have that put attitude, me in, right? Coach is there. Yeah. So, you know, looking outside and in, let's go ahead and go inside. Of course, we've got to put our yes. face mask on because this is going to be required. But the good news is that you don't have to be vaccinated to go inside to experience the rest of City Lights. You do not. Everyone is welcome in as long as you wear your mask. We're going to be managing the number of people that can be in here. So we might have a little bit of a wait, but we're so excited to welcome everyone. Oh, wonderful. And of course, we've been showing you inside all the different employee Christmas trees, but we want to show you more in the next half hour, including the signature Honolulu City Lights ornament and t-shirt this year. That's really cool, very personalized. So thank you so much, Miss, for everything that you've done. And we've been excited for Honolulu City Lights throughout the morning, so we appreciate you. Can't wait, thanks, Dallas. And we'll give you another live look in the next half hour. But of course, go to our website first at KHON2.com to get all the reminders you need. Reporting out here at the Honolulu Hale, Dallas Navarro's KHON2 News, working for Hawaii. Rain or shine. Rain or shine. The Put me in, coach. Yeah. Maybe Dallas will get the exclusive and go up there on the riser with Mayor. Little Pancioti. assist there. Yeah. <laughs> Coming up next, working for Hawaii with that weekend forecast. Plus, we'll show you Tesla.